Uh-huh. And here's another hit, Baby Bonds. Thank you so much for joining me on The Recess. You know, um, this is the IG Live series, but later we will have this on YouTube, podcast, you know, all the streaming sites and everything. So everyone who's joining or listening on demand, thank you for joining me, Coach E, OF Guru. I have Mark here with Jack's Batting Glove, the hottest batting gloves in Illinois right now. You know, yeah. we're doing great things. We're supporting small businesses. Make sure y'all send us to every baseball coach player that you know. We're going to make this thing go viral. Um, so before we get started, once again, this is Coach E. You're watching The Recess. The Recess is dedicated to shining a light on urban youth baseball and softball across the country and the wonderful things that we're doing. Um, we're dedicated to the grassroots levels. You know, we love ESPN. We love Fox Sports. We love the pros. But everything starts at the grassroots level. So we want to, I want to make sure that I gave the small business like Jack's Batting Glove, the coaches, everyone, a platform to display what they do great. So, Mark, not to be long-winded, I'm sorry. I have to get that out. Um, oh, man, all good. Yes. Can you tell the audience a little bit about Jack's Batting Glove Company? Jack's Batting Glove. Well, we've been um, been in business for about two years now, and uh, it's a partnership group of four. Uh, I got myself and my partner, uh, Daniel Jewett, uh, him and I played together at NIU. Um, we Shout another, out to the Huskies. Yeah, go Huskies. They're actually, I think they're playing today or tomorrow football-wise. So anyway, okay. that's another that's another thing. But uh, got another partner, JT Retzko. He was a uh, 10th round pick of the Marlins at a high school, um, Illinois guy. And then we have another partner um, who's a who's big baseball guy. Got a lot of, three of his kids are, are high-level baseball guys. Um, you know, so it's a, it's a, a partnership group. That's all baseball guys. You know, we have a slogan gloves made by hitters for hitters and we're, we're living it. So, um, you know, we've, we have a, we made a modification to a, to a batting glove that hasn't been done in 30 years. I don't think the batting glove has been touched. Um, you know, and we're a group of guys that, you know, JT kind of had a, a little bit of a, a tape thing that he did when he and you know he never dreamed it would turn into a product but it did and you know took a couple of years of development we finally turned it into a web and we had a 1.0 model and we did a 2.0 model and now we're on our pro model and it's been a great run and we've had uh, a lot of success and you know there's still a lot of ways to go but you know we're an Illinois based company we're you know we're in almost every state you know, we've crossed borders into about six or seven countries now. Um, so it's been a great ride, man. We're enjoying every second of it. Nice, man. I, I, I love what you guys are doing. Like, and, you know, just a small, quick story. You know, uh, we're limited on time. But sure. one of my kids, I'm not going to say his name, one of my kids in the program, he had, like, Jack's batting gloves. I'm like, hey, let me see those things. And I, you know, shook his hand. I'm like, whoa, these things are kind of padded. Now, did my research and saw the wonderful things that you're doing. So I, this is this is amazing for me. I'm so glad that this is happening. Um, Absolutely. So that's going to lead me to my next question. I know I heard you mention the padding and everything. So what makes you guys um, unique compared to other batting gloves in the, you know, other batting glove com uh, companies, I'm sorry, in the industry? Yeah. So we're, we have something called the web technology and the web technology is on your top hand. So, um, you know, the batting glove is going to come with a web glove and then a, a regular, uh, other glove and the webbing is going to be on your top hand and that that webbing you know for everyone on instagram live you can see it but for podcasts and whatnot it's going to be between your thumb and your index finger and it's going to be a web in there and inside the web we got um impact absorbing material so the gloves are going to do two main things it's going to protect your hand it's going to keep the the bat handle from getting deep into that web part of your hand so you get high impact it's going to keep that thumb pad protected. It's going to keep your hand from getting blown up, jammed. We all know what that feels like. No matter how good you are, it's going to happen. Um, and the, the main objective with the web is it's going to keep that bat in the front part of your hands. And what's that? That's going to allow you to do. It's going to allow you to give you more barrel control. It's going to allow you to, to you know, generate more whip, more, more speed through the zone. Because as everybody knows, you get that bat locked up, back there you get an over over the top grip too tight grip it's going to lock that hand up you're not going to be able to do you know explosive movements with that hand more muscle tension in the hand you know things of that nature so that's really what what separates us from everybody else you know obviously we think we got a premium batting glove we use the best materials out there but that web which we um, recently just got uh, our patent approved 
um, is something that nobody else has, and uh, we're super excited about it. Man, nice, nice. Um, you know, as a baseball coach and a dad, I don't coach my kids. You know, they're too young, and I, I always said I'm not going to coach my kids. But, um, you know, what are some things, especially for the moms, right, um, what are some things that you should look for when purchasing batting gloves? Yeah, I mean, it, it's all about, you know, what's the objective? Is it, is your, how many, how many games are you going to play? You know, is it, uh, you know, how often is your kid swinging? You know, is it, you know, there's, there's always going to be a debate. It's a tough thing because you're dealing with leather, right? And leather is a, is a tough product to maintain, you know, no matter what you, you know, what procedures you have in, leather's going to rip, you know what I mean? So I think comfort is the biggest thing. The gloves got to fit right. Um, you know, you want it to be durable, but I think the feel, how does the bat feel in the hand? I think a lot of people just buy batting gloves and just, you know, kind of just take them to the field and hope it feels good. You know, every batting glove is going to fit different. Everyone's going to have different stitching patterns. Everyone's going to have a different, um, wrist cuff, you know, the different straps, like, you know what I mean? So, and they're all going to fit different. So I think fit is the number one, uh, biggest advice I can give to anyone buying batting gloves because, you know, as hitter knows, as they get older, feel is such a big thing when you're at the plate so i think um you know if you're in a store put the gloves on and, and get a bat in your hands try to try to see what that feels like you know and i think um you know doing your best to make them last longer you know the advice i can give to the parents is that you see a lot of kids you know when they take that batting glove off they yank on the wrist or they they earn the bases with them and stuff like that you know those things will help them make it last a little bit longer but we were all there. I did it when I was a kid. You did it when we were a kid. But you know, their uh, comfort is my best my best uh, advice to to parents buying batting gloves for their kid. Okay, I know. Um, thank you for everyone who's commenting. I see uh, Jacks all day hashtag Jacks, Bam X, Bam, Am XO. I'm sorry if I if I butcher your name. Jacks all day. Um, baseball baller OG23 has asked, "How long on average should some good?" gloves last um you know there's that's the funny thing about batting gloves because you can you know it, the gloves you see in dicks and the gloves you you know you may buy online there's going to be you know a little insider to the business you know there's it's a different type of of uh product that's going in the stores that you might get online you know what i mean we're strictly online we haven't touched retail yet we we do that for a reason because we want to maintain the quality absolutely um, you know, higher expensive gloves, you know, they could, you know, they can last, you know, three, four games. Like we have, we have uh, all of our pro guys, you know, most of our guys, their gloves will last, you know, three, 4,000 swings. Nice. You know what I mean? But we might have a youth player that might go through them in a month. You know what I mean? Um, to answer your question, I think a lot of it comes down to, um, you know, if you're holding the bat right, you know, they should stay, they should last a little bit longer. I mean, if you're on the bases, you know, it's going to, it's going to wear and tear. It's going to challenge the leather, you know, yep, but I would say, tear, baby. I would say two, two sets of batting gloves should last a whole season. You know what I mean? That, that, that would be my uh, advice or, or my instinct on, on what they, how long they should last, but it's a great question. And, and like I said before, leather is a really, really tough, uh, product to um, master durability. So I think, you know, every batting glove, you know, shoe company or you know, bat or baseball glove company or anything, it's, it's, it's a, it's a moving target, you know, and it's, it's, it's tough to maintain, but um, you know, it's a great question. And I think, you know, at least, at least a couple months, I think is, is a fair, is a fair assessment of, of that. Absolutely, man. I see everybody, uh, you know, I, I, I got to engage with the audience right now. Uh, Elite Kid Baseball, whole oh, quick shout out, Elite Kid Baseball, one of the best infield coaches in the country, man. You got to follow his IG. Um, it's all about the field, just like a good pair of shoes. Oh, absolutely. If you uh, look good, you feel good. You feel good, you play good. You play good. Absolutely. You good. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I know our Coach Young jumped on from Tampa, Florida. Oh, man, we're making this thing reach. Um, another quick question. You know, these, I, I got to give my audience, you know, an opportunity to engage. I know, um, Mark, you're a busy man, but um, insert a good Instagram name. He's a coach and a dad as well. He said, do you have a model for switch hitters so they don't have to buy two pairs? Very good question. I, I smile because that is literally something that we've been talking about 
Yes. Um, because that, that, that question has come up often. And to answer your question, no, we do not um, currently, but we are going to make an adjustment to our website where if there is a switch hitter, um, they can choose between, um, you know, getting a, a, you know, kind of a two web, you know, kind of combo package type thing. Um, you know, it's funny because we have some, some of our college guys and some of our minor league guys, they wear webs on both hands because uh, they like how it feels, but we definitely need to make that adjustment. You know, we're, we're a growing business too. And, and, Absolutely. Uh, you know, we, we love that feedback and, and you're not the, you're not the first one. And until we make that change, you're not going to be the last one. So we, we, we definitely need to make that change. And we hope to have that option, um, you know, for the Christmas buying season. If not, definitely 2021, we're going to make that switch. Nice. Um, I got to take a couple more questions. They, they engage. They, I, I got Hey, it. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. Love it. yeah it's just go. like a coach. If we're yeah. bunting, we're going to bunt till they, till they stop the play. Uh, no. Um, Ken Dizzle, 88, says, my 2020 year I'm only, I'm only using is at – Axe bat. I'm sorry, I'm butchering this, but it, the feet, the comments are going. I'm only using it as axe bats. I'm buying all the softball bats. Please start making shirts and hats, bat gloves, so I can wear it all summer. I play every weekend of the summer. Hey, thanks for the feedback, Jax. They 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 need you to make some more stuff. Yeah, the appa the apparel, more colors. You know, we uh, we've done the limited edition stuff. You know, in our first two years, but more colors are coming. Apparel is coming. Absolutely. I saw a question in there about customizable gloves. We do have a team sales program that we can do fully customizable gloves um, for team sales, you know, youth teams, travel programs. We give you, you know, we're going to be the only guiding love company out there. We're going to take our logo off and we're going to put your team logo on. Say that you one know. more time. I, I got a saying at the recess. Say it for the people in the back. You know, this yeah. is like a Baptist church. Say it for the people in the back. We are going to be the only batting glove company that's going to take our logo off and put your logo on in, uh, for our team sales program, something we're super excited about that we're going to launch in the next couple of weeks. Um, it's a great way to engage with the, with the, with the programs and, and give them something that no other batting glove company is, is going to do that. We got the web and we're going to take our logo off. Who else is going to say that? I don't think too many, too many companies are going to do that. Man, my DJ is not here today unless we would have, we to put on the theme song after that. No, definitely. Yeah. That's great. That's awesome. You know, and especially guys from Illinois, you know, we're making this Illinois baseball thing go through the roof. The best baseball state in the country. You heard it here first. No pun intended to anybody. Um, but I got to ask you, can you walk us through? I know it's a very detailed process, but can you give us just a, so a small, I'm sorry, snippet? or basically just scratching the surface of how a batting glove is actually made, the science of making a batting glove. That is a good, that's, a, that's probably the best question for my, uh, my main man, DJ, because he is the product development master. Okay. Um, I'm more the business strategy guy and, and that stuff. But, um, you know, it is a very, it is a very extensive process. You know, it, it's coming from different types of animals, you know, goat skin, sheep skin, you're trying, you know, each part of the, 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 the skin has a, has a better quality of yeah. leather, you know, so you're trying to get the best cuts, you're stretching it out, you're putting the print in, you're cutting that out. So if you look at a batting glove here, sorry, podcast listeners, you can't see that, but you're going to have your front side, you're going to have your back side, you're going to have your, your wrist, you're going to have your strap. So it's developing each side, making sure that they're all in the right spots and, and stitching up there. Then putting the, the top and the, and the, and the bottom together with us, then you got to sew in the web on one of those gloves, which is a, is a very difficult process. You got to put the impact absorb, absorbing material in there, get that leather piece snipped up. Then you got to put that back into the, into the wrist cuff. So I probably didn't do the best job explaining that it's, it's a very delicate process. It's a multi-step process, different stations, but the most interesting fact is, is, you know, when you're getting the, the, the sheet of, of, you know, whether it's sheepskin or goat skin, you know, the different parts of the animal have uh, better, but more, more high quality leather. And that's, that's really tough to, to, uh, you know, figure out, but um, we're going to actually going to be posting some videos of our gloves being made here pretty soon, which I think is going to be really, really cool. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a very interesting and, you know, uh, delicate process. You know, and it's 
take some, you, you never think, you know, you never think about your batting gloves until you, when, but then when you start actually making them and you're like, man, look at all the, you start paying attention to all the stitching and how everything is. And it's, it's an amazing process. And we hope to educate everybody on that real soon. Okay. I had a um, comment um, from a parent and a coach, any local demo days? Uh, you know, man, that's, it's, we're, we're disappointed, you know, obviously stuff out of our control with, with, you know, with COVID. COVID, yeah. It, it's been a challenge for everybody and and we really we had a plan of of really getting into especially illinois you know and getting to a lot of the facilities and just and just doing demos and you know doing something what we call the jacks challenge where you know you try our glove try regular gloves you know you do get on the hit man hit tra uh hit tracks and you know seeing what your launch angle is exit below and then putting our gloves on and seeing what the difference is um we want to do it where as soon as it's safe and soon as, you know, facilities are, are kind of comfortable with getting their stuff going and having guests in, we're definitely going to plan to do something like that. Um, you know, but obviously with the times now, we just got to do what's, what's safe for everybody. And, you know, it's a bummer, but you understand, right? Oh, absolutely. You better understand. Yeah. If, yeah. How you going to play if you're sick? Mm. <laughs> yeah. We just want, we want this thing to, we want, you know, to, we want this thing to, to end in a in a as best way it possibly can and get back to to what we love to do and but you Absolutely. know we we know that it's out of our control right now. So I know you know I'm going to get flooded with a thousand questions after this for someone who sees it on demand and or someone hey what do you guys talk about um or hey I'm interested in Jack's batting gloves how how can I get a pair or purchase a pair can you provide for the audience where and how they can purchase a pair of Jack's batting gloves. Yeah, so we're we're strictly online. So jacksbattinggloves.com. So J A X battinggloves.com. Uh, follow us on Instagram at Jacks Batting Gloves, Facebook at Jacks Batting Gloves. Um, yeah, strictly online is where is where you can get them. Um, so just jacksbattinggloves.com. We're, you know, like I said before, you know, the retail spot is 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 interesting to us. But right now we're just doing strictly online. Um, you know, for team sales, if you guys are interested in doing customized stuff for your, your teams or your programs, youth, high school, college, um, you know, you can email us at, uh, that's team sales, team sales at jacksbattinggloves.com. And, uh, we'll, we'll get the process started and, and, uh, there. So, you know, straight up website, team sales at jacksbattinggloves.com. Either way, we'll take care of you, but, uh, that's where you can get us. Man, nice, nice. Mark, I could talk all night, man. I know. Yeah, me too, man. I'm really, yeah. I, I, this is definitely only part one. We're going to have a part two coming out yeah, right before I'm, the Yeah, let's end. book it. Absolutely. We're, we're going to go, matter of fact, when this when it gets safe back outside, uh, we're going to go live. We'll do the, the Jacks. Yeah, we'll do the Jacks challenge, me and you. Oh, let's, let's do, do it. it. Let's do it. Yeah. Well, yeah. So, hey, everyone who's watching on YouTube or watching IG Live, make sure the first things first, make sure you go follow me on Instagram. Coach E O F Guru, make sure you follow. Make sure uh, you repost this video. Make sure you go follow Jack's Batting Glove on Instagram. Make sure y'all go cop a pair of Jack's Batting Glove. Make sure you also visit Coach E O F Guru dot com the site. Hey Mark, thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining me on the recess. You, my my partner just do, just joined Daniel Jewett, so it's funny that that he got in after you asked me the the, the question on how they how they make. Where were you on that one? DJ? Well, DJ, like, where, yeah, DJ yeah. part two, man. When, when me and Mark did yeah. the uh, Jack's challenge, I want you there live and walking me through how you made this bag glove and how he's he a, the he, breaks off this ball. He's a he's a master of of product development, man. He's done an unbelievable job with this stuff. So he is a he's a genius when it comes to it. So it's a it's a good team. Put it that way. Good double play combo. I like the. Oh, absolutely, six four. Hey, yeah. uh, DJ, I'm gonna have to get a coach E uh, coach E model with Jack's back. I don't know, man. I gotta get so in right up, now before y'all. He's up. He's up. He's up to the challenge, no doubt. Absolutely, man. Mark, thank you once again for joining me on the recess. I you, man. Follow Coach EOF Guru. Follow Jack's Batting Gloves. Visit the websites. Make sure y'all tune in next week to another episode of The Recess.